sunrise. The beautiful coast of South Devon, where land meets sea and life thrives. Nestled in a sheltered bay is the small town of Brixham. With a rich history of fishing, its harbour is packed with boats day and night. The busy fish market draws people throughout the year. But it's not just people drawn here, Brixham is also a magnet for wildlife. But it's autumn, and for a few brief months, Brixham will host some very special visitors. Seals. From October each year, Atlantic grey seals start to gather around the harbour. For new arrivals, it's a chance to stretch, to rest, to relax, and sometimes to play. They can be plump. They can be playful and sometimes a little bit clumsy. As one of the UK's busiest fishing ports, every day sees boats return to harbour as others head back out to sea. They head out to catch fish or to lay pots for crabs and lobsters. With so many natural resources and seafood being landed, there are plenty of feeding opportunities for the local wildlife. Tucked away amongst all this industry, the seals take advantage of any available area. The man-made pontoons provide the perfect sheltered spots. Unconnected to land, they are out of reach of humans. At the start of autumn, there is plenty of room, but as the pontoons fill up, some can make you feel unwelcome. A young male. He might have made it out of the water, but being allowed to stay is a whole other matter. That's it. Pass the first hurdle and securely onto the pontoon. He heads around the back of the group, but where is the best spot? Ah, that's an alpha male. And he is not moving. Undeterred, the young male spots a smaller, unsuspecting target. Success. Plenty of space and time to enjoy. Sharing isn't always easy. Some prefer a spot for one. And others head out to explore the coastline. Away from the hectic world of humans, they are free to explore unhindered. Whilst they might appear plump and clumsy on land, in the sea it's their grace, agility and power that shines through true masters of the sea.
back on the pontoon, it's playtime. These three juveniles are play wrestling. Plenty of teeth on display, but no real biting as they roll each other into the sea. This is an essential part in developing skills they will need as adults if they are to defend a territory. But maybe a slap won't be enough. If they aren't sure how it should be done, fully grown males are happy to provide a demonstration. Most fights start with low hissing and head rolling as opponents size each other up. If neither backs down, then the teeth and the claws come out. But fighting on land is tiring and the whole battle rarely lasts long. But not always. This battle is over, but grey seals face an uncertain future in a world dominated by humans. Their brief stay in Brixen shows a lighter, playful and often endearing side to their nature, but their social interactions are complex, as is their lifestyle. When they do leave Brixen, they will range along the coast and rarely gather in large numbers until next autumn. As more people move to the coast and take up activities on the water, there are few true secret coves or secluded beaches where seals can rest undisturbed. We need to remember wildlife needs space. Wildlife needs us to be kind.